This is the dashboard. This time I'll demonstrate how to edit profile. On the upper right side you'll see the menu. Click this and you can see the breadcrumb. That composes of dashboard, profile, grades, and etc. Then click the profile. You will be directed to the user details. If you want to edit your profile, click this. And you can start changing your personal information. For your user picture you can take from your documents and upload it here. And there are other information such additional names, interest and etc. No need to put such information, however if you want to have it in there and post this on the front page you do that by simply typing the content. Then after updating your personal profile, click this to finish update. Now I'll demonstrate how to receive and send messages. Again on the upper right side you'll see the menu. Click this and you can see the breadcrumb that composes of dashboard, profile, grades, and etc. Then click this. In order to direct you in here. These are the messages that you received from your students. You can choose one of the messages if you wish to reply. This time you can see accept and add to contacts or decline. If you want to add your student just click this. Now you can start your conversation with your student. Then click this. However if you want to message a specific student of yours that is not yet in your contacts, you can click here and search. As you can see the student you are looking for is under non-contacts. Therefore in order to add him in your contacts you need to click this. On the right side of your student's name you can see three dots. Click this three dots and add your student to your contacts. As you can see you can add him or not. So you decided to add him. Now your contact request has been sent. However your student is not in your contacts yes because he need to accept your request. There is another one way to access the messages you received and send. On the upper right side you'll see the messaging drawer. Click one of the messages you've received. As you can observe, the same as a while ago. The student sent a request to you and you can add him to your contacts. Then you can start reading the messages you've received or your conversation with your students.